Elementary school mathematics. Simple, right? What may seem simple for you and I is actually the foundation of mathematics. Early concepts of number and combinations form the basis for a successful study of math in the later grades. When students don't develop a solid understanding of these concepts, they have holes in their foundation. These gaps in understanding make the foundation weak, and students begin to struggle with new concepts. This is when students need intervention, a carefully developed plan that addresses the holes in their foundation and makes new learning possible. So it's important that educators know which concepts students understand, and which ones they don't, so that they can meet the needs of every student. Kathy Richardson is one of the nation's leading elementary math educators and the author of several publications. She's also the program director of the Math Perspectives Teacher Development Center in Bellingham, Washington. Her work is supported by the most recent research in math education and her own classroom experiences. After years of research in K-2 classrooms, Kathy developed Assessing Math Concepts, a series of nine assessments that uncover students' illusions of learning and reveal what they really understand. Teachers use this level to guide instruction so that students are working at the most appropriate level for maximum growth and understanding. The interview style assessments are both diagnostic, in that they identify gaps in children's understanding, and prescriptive, as they identify activities that will help students build these critical understandings. Detailed assessment results help teachers plan for intervention. The class benchmark report shows students who are still working towards a specified benchmark and those that have already met the benchmark. The class instruction report allows teachers to group students or to provide individualized support to address gaps in their understanding. Teachers know, concept by concept, whether students are ready to apply their knowledge, need practice with the concept, or need instruction. Having discovered the students' working levels, teachers are then able to identify activities in the Developing Number Concepts books that are appropriate for each student. These engaging, hands-on activities can be used with the whole class, in small groups, or in one-on-one -on -one instruction. The Developing Number Concepts books are organized by concept, not by grade, and include resources for the teacher and for students in a clear, easy-to-follow format. Together, assessing math concepts and developing number concepts provide a complete solution for early math intervention using the RTI or MTSS models. Assessing all students helps teachers see which students are working at grade level and which students need additional instruction beyond the core. These students use the developing number concepts activities to build their understanding and fill in the gaps. The assessments are used again for progress monitoring to determine if students have met the benchmark or whether a more targeted intervention with developing number concepts is required. If you're looking for an early math intervention solution that provides formative assessments that are both diagnostic and prescriptive, that link to high-quality hands-on instructional activities, and include detailed online reporting, then you've found it. Assessing Math Concepts by Kathy Richardson. For more information about assessing math concepts and developing number concepts, or to set up a demonstration of our online reporting system, contact your Didax representative or visit us online.